Auto Mall Drive. Live, local, late breaking. This is your first alert forecast. Hi there, welcome back to the Greek Festival. We're at Greek Fest 2012, and check out the volunteers who worked so hard putting this on. Remember, a big part of the Greek Festival, a big part of it is that they're raising money so that they can feed the less privileged, less fortunate on Thanksgiving. It's a big part of what they do here at St. Demetrios. Volunteers doing some good work. Let's check your forecast. It's kind of hot right now, but not so bad in the shade. Even with the fire and the flame back here, it's not too bad. Our temps will drop down tonight into the um, upper uh, 60s to low 70s in the city. You know, another thing happening all weekend is Oktoberfest. It's happening up on Mount Lemmon. And if you're interested in the first weekend of Oktoberfest, overnight lows in the upper 40s, daytime highs right around 70. So our overnight low is what Mount Lemmon will see for a daytime high all weekend. Uh, speaking of high, our pollen count is going even higher because of ragweed. It's mostly ragweed. I don't know about you, but I've had my first allergy attack of the season. Had it today, so autumn is officially on its way. As a matter of fact, autumn starts tomorrow, 7.49 in the morning, just before 8 o'clock. So as most of you are waking up, the sun's direct rays will be right over the top of the uh, equator um, on their way down south. Eventually, they'll make it to the Tropic of Capricorn down south. But all in all, our days keep getting shorter, okay. while tomorrow will be a day of fairly equal daylight and darkness hours. It's that time of the year. It is the first day of autumn, the autumn equinox. Happy autumn, everyone. Our daytime high today has been up to 100. I thought maybe it would officially come in at 101, but it didn't. But it's still seven above average, five below the record for this date, though. Here's the official forecast, at least my official forecast for tonight, with all the autumn leaves going on. Don't you wish we looked like that right now? 84 degrees by 8 o'clock on this Friday night. Tomorrow morning down to around 70. We'll call that lovely for a morning hike. Tomorrow afternoon, hot again with a high of 100. Record for tomorrow is 106, so we at least are not at record-breaking numbers. It always gets hot right at the Greek Festival. It's our last big kick of the heat, and it's here to say opa in our faces, right? 97 degrees right now, but look at the humidity. It's only 11%, so it feels very comfortable. Miriam is in the making. You can see it right there, and it looks to me as though Miriam will make it up our way. So on the seven-day, I've got a watching Miriam part of the seven-day forecast. You'll see that when it folds from the three-day to the seven-day. This weekend, 100 tomorrow, 98 on Sunday as we cool down slightly as the high pressure breaks a bit. Then on Monday, middle 90s for highs. Yom Kippur begins Tuesday at sundown. Then we will be watching Miriam starting Wednesday. It looks like an influx of moisture with a pretty substantial chance for rainfall. Hey, um, guys back in the station, what kind of thing would you like me to bring back for you? Uh, I'm just teasing. I won't really, but what would you like? One thing? Uh, one, of, one of everything, Chuck. What are you talking <laughs> yeah, about? Right? How about some Spanakopita? Definitely. You know, whenever, I, whenever I volunteer and work in the lines out here, I always make a mistake on the first couple of orders. So I'll mess up Spanakopita and Pastizio, and I'll get it all mixed up. And this first lady who came through the line, very nice, but she ordered everything to go into to-go boxes like this. Uh -huh. And... Um, she got it all out and it was all wrong. So oh. we totally messed that up. We'll take those boxes, Chuck. <laughs> You know, I'm impressed though, Chuck. I don't know the names of any of these dishes. I just point like that looks good. That looks good. So, if you if you did this every year, you would. The biggest thing is don't call it a gyro or a gyro yes. or a. Don't do that. It's I a learned euro. That my first euro. euro. You can yes. even roll the R a little and euro. sound just like the Greeks out here. There you go. There you go. All right, Chuck. Thanks so much. Well, between we'll see at six. between the Greek festival, Oktoberfest, fall colors. This is my favorite. So time much of going the year. on. We're gonna gain ten pounds before the weekend is mm -hmm. over. It's our favorite part. Well, Tucson Internet.